guys, it's Chris Bond from the Sock Mob blog. Today I'm going to be showing you how to jet insufflate doing a cricothyrotomy. So, what are you going to need for this? Bag connected to an oxygen source. A cric trainer. If you don't know how to make one, watch my previous video. People told me that I did a lot of vano whiting during that video, so I'm going to try and tone that down today. But I do like to do this a little bit. So, in addition to that, you're going to need your shortest fattest gauge catheter you can find in the eMERGE. I have a 14 gauge, one and a quarter inch long cath line. Then you're going to need these two pieces of equipment. This is the adapter from a 7O endotracheal tube, and this is a 3cc syringe. The reason why you need these two exactly is because the 7O endotracheal tube adapter fits snugly into a 3cc syringe. This is going to allow you to MacGyver a lot more things that you think about in the future. So, at this point, take your 14 gauge catheter, landmark for your crike, and you'll also notice I've attached a glove to represent lungs. Pretty high tech stuff. So landmarking for your crike, thyroid cartilage, cricoid cartilage, cricothyroid membrane in between. Insert your needle, feel it go through the tracheal rings, remove your needle, now you have your catheter attached. Now at this point you're going to get somebody to hold this and make it secure or you're going to tie it down. Now you attach your syringe with your ET tube adapter. Now you can bag through this. So you're going to meet quite a bit of airway resistance as you can imagine from the dead space. But you can see it's doing a fine job of inflating a lung. So especially if you needed to do this in a little kid, something like that, where you're definitely not going to be doing a knife technique a needle technique is going to work really well, and this jet insufflation equipment is something you're going to have pretty much on any emergency airway, in any emergency airway bag or cart or anything like that. So, thanks very much for watching. This is Chris Bond from the Sock Mod blog. Until next time.